I'm Ed Gillespie, I'm co-founder of Futera Sustainability Communications uh, and five years ago I went around the world without flying. Um, I think the main reason I love to come to the Green Tourism Conference is because you know it's the one event in the year where you get the great gathering of the clan. It's where you get the insights, it's where you get the best ideas being shared, uh, and it's where you get that kind of sustenance and provocation to sustain you through the rest of the year and keep doing what you're supposed to be doing, which is actually making tourism greener, more appealing, uh, and the kind of fantastic industry that it should be. And do you think that customers understand uh, I think customers uh, of, of tourism have a mixed kind of understanding of what green is these days. I think there's a lot of superficial stuff which can fish people in, uh, but equally there's some really substantive work which can actually end up, end up being what we call better tourism. If, if you engage credibly and seriously with green, then you create a better, more fulfilling, more rewarding, a richer tourism experience. And, you know, and that's what everyone should be looking for, that sense of authenticity. Do you think No, I think people get very confused about what's credible in, in the context of green tourism. As I say, there's a lot of um, signposting that might be misleading, uh, and people find it hard to understand uh, you know, what, what the kind of substantive work that's gone on to make a, a green tourism destination or facility or venue genuinely sustainable. So uh, you need to have accreditation, you need to have something which is simple and visible, which can give people the confidence that what's been done is authentic uh, and, and actually means something and is going to make a difference. And what do you see the future for green tourism business scheme going forward? Well, green tourism is the future. Um, so it's not just about making it a business scheme. It's like, this is the way the world is going. Uh, this is the way that all industries and all sectors are ultimately shifting towards, you know, whether we're talking about energy, whether we're talking about finance, whether we're talking about transport. Uh, tourism is no ex exception. And if tourism is not adding to the sum total of human capital, environmental capital and social capital in the world, then it needs to be looking quite carefully at itself. Um, and so I, I remain an optimist. I'm always hopeful. Uh, and I think generally we're always going in the right direction.